workplaces use cleaning chemicals to ensure the cleanliness of their buildings. Workers who frequently handle these products include building maintenance workers, janitors, and housekeepers, among others. Many of these same chemicals are also frequently used in people's homes as well. Many factors influence whether a cleaning chemical will cause health problems. Some important factors to consider include the chemical ingredients of the cleaning product, how the cleaning product is being used or stored, ventilation in the area where the cleaning product is used, whether there are splashes and spills, whether the cleaning product comes in contact with the skin, and whether mists, vapors, and or gases are released. Chemicals in some cleaning products can be irritating to the skin or can cause rashes. Cleaning products that contain corrosive chemicals can cause severe burns if splashed on the skin or in the eyes. Mists, vapors, and or gases from cleaning chemicals can irritate the eyes, nose, throat, and lungs. Symptoms may include burning eyes, sore throat, coughing, trouble breathing, and wheezing. Chemicals in some cleaning products can cause asthma or trigger asthma attacks. Some cleaning products even contain hazardous chemicals that can enter the body through skin contact or from breathing gases into the lungs. People should be especially vigilant to not mix cleaning products that contain bleach and ammonia as they can cause severe lung damage or even death. Employers need to provide safe working conditions for employees using cleaning chemicals and those throughout the area. When cleaning chemicals are hazardous, employees must be trained on safe work practices for using those products. These are just a few things to know about the use of cleaning chemicals, indoor environments, and protecting workers. To learn more about this or other indoor air quality, health and safety, and environmental issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.